Okay, welcome to this channel. In this video, let me show you how to make this exercise. Okay, here the dimension for this part. And then let's make a modeling part now. From this SOLIDWORKS interface, let's start from click a file, new, and we click a part. So, yeah. Okay, from this one, let's start from front plan, click a sketch, and then I want to click a for this mid point line or just click a line. Let's make the four vertical line. Right click and click select. Maybe I want to make a plain white for this background. Okay, the first one I want to set the its line to let click for this goal. Hmm. This is our guide for our sketch. Uh, it has for bigger diameter for the circle it's around about 60 millimeter apply just click enter okay let's define from this one to this make it for 80 millimeter okay and then from this one to this one let's set for 36 millimeter okay and then click to this midpoint line click to this point right click then click select give us more dimension let's set for 60 millimeter okay and then let's click to this line this point and then click this one right click then click select okay next step let's make it for let's make more this horizontal line from this one and then connect to this one then I want to delete for this unnecessary line yes okay Dimension. Hmm. Let's define for there is 36 millimeter. Okay. And let's define for the smart dimension. This give for this 30 millimeter. And it is 30, it's from half from this 60 millimeter. Okay, look how our sketch is fully defined. Fully defined. Uh, click, uh, I just want to extend this sketch, maybe. And then let's delete for this ancestry line. Click trim and this time to close and select this one. And then I want to delete this. Okay, then from this sketch, let's uh, give a thickness by click of readers, then extra plus. Okay, from this one, you can change for mid pen. Let's set value or field to 42 plus that is 9 and plus 9 from the other side so it's equal to 60 millimeter too okay from this one you can click okay ah. and then i want to sketch from this surface just click to the surface and then you can click sketch and then select for this circle Let's define for this point. 
can just click hot swan hmm. look you can click hot swan let's click a smart dimension and then change for diameter to 40 millimeter and next you can click to this circle and make it for the smaller one and diameter to 30 millimeter next click to the circle then set for 18 millimeter okay next click a feeders then extra cut that's extra from this one make sure just click a blind then from this dialogs click a select counter the first one I want to set for diameter 4c okay set the value uh, the depth is 20 millimeter and then okay yep and the next step we can click to this surface and then click sketch just click to this sketch let's let's make it a convert entity so this sketch will appear to the surface and then click on video you can click extra cut you can select contour for this one let's define for its depth to 20 millimeter okay next step you can make for the same way click to the surface and then click the sketch click to this sketch you can make it convert in this and then make it for the smallest one you can click here then extra cut so this one okay you can make it 20 millimeter or just click a draw hole and play. the next step let's make it for in this sketch from the surface click click sketch click a circle make it for the smaller one and then click a smart dimension for the first one make it a 24 millimeter fly and the smaller one and it's round about 40 feeders and then go to extra cuts Just click a blind, select control, you can click for this one. Set the value to 20 millimeter. Apply. Next, sketch to the sketch, you can click a uh, sketch. Expand this toggle can click the sketch and then convert this let's click the feeders then extra cut you can select for this one by click set counter you can click one make it for 25 millimeter And next step from this sides you can just click a mirror mirror you can mirror but you can just click to this one too 
and then click a mirror from the mirror face plan you can expand for this toggle you can select for right or sorry look for front plan you can see the yellow preview will here and then apply okay next step you can sketch from the surface click sketch let's define for center rectangle click from this point click a smart dimension and set for this length to 80 mm and then for this first one 80 mm or it's catch is equal apply click to the circle let's define for the first one let's click for the smaller one and it's round about 16 mm and then the bigger one twenty six in the okay from this one you can click a trim and this and I want to do that for the ancestral line. Okay. You can click uh, for construction. I'm sorry, I click select from this line. Hmm, sorry. From this one, you can click this line. Make it for construction. And set for this one. Right click and press select. Okay, let's click a trim entities. I want to delete from this catch or okay. Let's a mirror entities. Mirror about for the first one. Let's select for this line. And it is a mirror. You can select from this catch. Apply. Next, you can click mirror and it is mirror about this line. And it is to mirror. You can select all these gaps. Apply. You can make it all black. Click a video, then exit box. Just make it a blind and set for its thickness. Okay, you can make it for 10 millimeter, or you can make it your optional value from this one because there is the information that fix for this one. For example, I want to make it for 10 millimeter, then apply. Control 7 to make the asymmetric view. Looks, it's almost done from this part, but 
there's uh, something we can make from this upper the surface let's set for uh, its position from top line click a top line or we can sketch from click to this this one just a uh, reference geometry plan so I want to make it for 36 plus 80 plus 30 plus and it is and it's hack for a millimeter okay and then okay yep right click close this plan and then you can click sketch go to the circle start from the origin click a smart dimension let's set for 8 millimeter enter and make it for the bigger one Okay, and then let's go to this one. Connect, right click, then click select. Okay, let's trim entities. Yep, okay, and then go to feeders, and then let's click for extra box make it for up to surface set a counter for this sketch up to surface this one mm. up to surface this one I'm sorry Let's do that for this one. Turn to close. Select this one. Click of readers. Then click a uh, extra boss. Up the surface. Just click the surface. Okay. Next step. Click to this one. Click a sketch. You can click to the circle and then just make it for one connect either than after cut. You can just drag for cut this one or yep okay and let's hide for this plane. Finally the part is done. Okay, if you want to change for this appearance, you can click for this one. For example, I want to make it for metal. Just click for this steel, maybe maybe a brush steel. Just I want to make it a brush steel and apply. Okay, guys, the part is done. I hope you can follow this tutorial clearly and if you want have a request or some tutorial you can comment in this comment section below. See you on my next video.